All right, <clears throat> just want to make a video here. Um, I ordered a new coffee table. Uh, I've had this uh, coffee table; it's well overdue to be replaced. Um, you can see it's got a lot of years and wear and tear on it. And then lately, uh, anything hot has been ruining the uh, surface here. Anyways, I've had this coffee table here since I don't know late nineties. Um, I was at a friend's house uh, during the holidays and noticed he had a new coffee table and I was like, you know what, I really need to <laughs> replace my coffee table. So anyways, um, ordered it from Amazon and sure enough, two days shows up um, from Amazon Prime. The only complaint I have is the corner of the box is ripped. But it doesn't appear to have any damage. I'll take a look at it here in just a minute once I get the box opened. Um, but it shows up even in two days, and we have some pretty nasty weather here in Cincinnati right now. But, uh, you know, Amazon Prime, they're on it. So give me a few minutes, I'll get this unboxed, and we'll come right back. All right, initial opening of the box. Nothing appears to look damaged. Looks like all the pieces are labeled. I'm very excited about this. Looks like a pretty neat coffee table. Uh, like I said, I saw it in person at a friend's house over the holidays. And was impressed. The uh, It has two storage drawers below. And then this top actually lifts up to make a table top, and there's also storage underneath here as well. I'll uh, start unboxing all this. I'll be right back. Everything is labeled. One of our friends, uh, Caleb, here wants to check things out. You know how cats are curious about everything. Alright, time to start putting this together. Alright, here's the finished product, and I couldn't be happier. Um... So it took me, I'm not really mechanically inclined, it took me about an hour and a half to assemble it. Um, all straightforward, I didn't like mess up and have to go back. Sometimes when you assemble stuff, it's like, whoops, I, mess, I messed up and I'm step and have to go back and fix something. Very straightforward, directions were great. Um, only other tool that wasn't, in, really the only tool that's included with it that you need is a small screwdriver that comes with it. Um, it's pretty small and works out perfect. Um, only other thing I grabbed was a pair of scissors just to cut open the little plastic baggies, but I'm sure you could rip them open without using scissors if need be. Um, so the options when you assemble it are, do you want the drawers to be facing outward or do you want the drawers facing inward? Um, so the reason there's an out or an in, I just wanted the drawers out just so it'd be easier to put miscellaneous stuff like remote controls or magazines. There's the drawer open. There's the instruction manual. Come with a couple extra uh, little covers, little stickers. Came with an extra pack of just spare parts. I didn't have to get any spare parts. Some little plastic things if you need to level it or protect the corners. So the reason I'm saying uh, this is my favorite part about this is that the top lifts up whether you want to eat on it, whether you want to read a magazine, or whether you want to do like a crossword puzzle, need to write paper on it. So let me show you. You sit down on your couch and as easily as probably can't tell from this angle I'll make a different angle for you but now 
it's up above my knees perfectly. And it's the perfect height for me to ride on while I'm sitting on the couch, read, um, eat a snack or something, like a sandwich. Pushes right back down, right back into place. Let's see if I can show from a different angle. So like when you're sitting on the couch, you pull it open, and now look at it. So sitting on the couch, it's the perfect height for me. The top opens up for more storage. I'm sure I can take these extra stickers off now. But I mean, there's plenty of room for storage of magazines and remote controls, let alone these drawers here. So what I'm saying is, if you wanted the drawers to be facing inward towards your couch, the top hinges, you could have flipped the top completely 180 degrees. So instead of the top opening that direction, the top would have opened up this direction, which is nice for people that have that, you know, want that option. Um, another thing I like about it is that it's very heavy duty. It's not a light piece of furniture by any means. I believe the box shipping weight was like 56 or 58 pounds. Um, so it's not a light table that's going to move around or scoot on you. But so far, I love it. Um, like I said, I purchased it off of Amazon. I believe it was $169 um, for... Uh, maybe $1.99. There was a bigger option. Oh, look, the cat brought us a toy. I guess we're ignoring him. What are you doing, Caleb? Is this yours? Uh, so for $1.99, there is a larger option. I think for $1.69, this is the perfect size for me. And it comes in three or four different color combinations. I know there was a dark espresso brown. There was even a black. But I just, well, I like this. I really like this wood grain design. Um, and the company, uh, I can't think of the name off the top of my head, but they sell a lot of other products. And now that I've purchased this one and I like it, I'm probably going to start buying, I'll probably either get the end tables next or some bookcases next to my fireplace. I need something over here. Need something over here. They make like a ladder rack and some bookcases. And that's Jack there. He's watching us. And then we got Caleb over here. Uh, he's just laying out. But I um, hope this video was informative for you. And so far, I give this an A+. I'll make another video probably a month from now. And just kind of give you an update, say how much I like it or dislike it, or if I have any complaints about it. But so far, I am completely satisfied. There was no nicks, no flaws, no nothing coming out of the box. There's no scratches on it whatsoever. I'm pretty picky about assembling stuff, make sure not to mess it up. But like I said, it was pretty easy to put together. Uh, it did take me an hour and a half. I did take a maybe a five, ten minute coffee break. But something that anybody can assemble. And so far, I give the product an A+. Thanks for watching. Hope this is informative. I'll put the link below in the description to Amazon where I bought it from. Um, and if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Um, and I'll make a couple more videos as I buy more products from this company. Thank you very much for watching.